This is not possible. Not under my nose. No one is killing Peter. Pause. This is a work. We have been paid for. No emotion, sir. United we stand. Divided we fall. Unity as enshrined by the scripture is partnering together to work towards uplifting a kind of belief system. Do you know that if 50,000 people watch our movies, as we have always experienced even more, and just 500 people like the movie, we have just told YouTube that out of the 50,000 that watched our movie, only 500 people loved it. It means that 49,500 did not like the movie. Do you know what YouTube will do? They will automatically remove that video from their recommended videos. And that will not allow a lot of people to see it. Why would you come and watch a video, love the video, and be blessed by the video and refuse to like the video? We can do that now. Let's change the mentality. Even as you're watching me now, click the like button. If you're watching over a telly, log in on your phone and click the like button. The more the like, the more the videos go around the world and are recommended across the globe. Don't you want people to be blessed by this same content? Then like. Share the video on your various social media platforms. Comment on the videos and click the subscribe button. Thank you very much and God bless you. What is it? Oh, my darling. How are you? I hope they are not giving you any problem in this house. Oh, that's good. Oh, go ahead. Go and finish your food. Adekule, no talk to me. If you jati jati will over me try, what do you expect me to do with just a hundred thousand naira? No talk to me. So, Milola, what's the meaning of this? You asked me for money for your wife here, yeah? and I gave you money. I sent a hundred thousand naira to you. Is this what I get in return? Is that what you give your wife? How do you expect me to manage that token for my welfare? I need to change my wardrobe, buy new hair, do a little touch up here and there. How many times do you change your wardrobe in a year? As many times as possible. Or do you expect me to dress anyhow? You have the money, so what? And I cannot continue to waste my hard-earned money anyhow. If what I have given to you is not satisfied by you, then return it. Let me have some peace. You are joking. Whoa, oh, Siri, where You think you can use me and dump me and throw me out? Hm. We die here. Hey, hey, hey. Oni, Oni, please. Just give her whatever thing she asks for, please. At least for peace to reign in this house. Remember, she has a song for you. And I don't. Just. Please, please. Yeah. Oh. Oh. This is the first time you're going to say something sensible. You better talk to him. Talk to him, oh. If he doesn't give me extra money, there will be war in this house. 
Just imagine the way you talk to my wife. And what am I? Eh? Talk to me! What am I? <sighs> okay, okay, okay. It's alright. I'll send you more money before noon. Just go. Better. Nonsense. John, my darling. I would need you to take care of yourself, okay? And do not let anybody intimidate you in this house. This is your father's house. And remember, you are the eldest. Okay? Take care. Before noon. Kiwani I have the right to reject every negative utterance you pronounce against me in Jesus' name. What is it? Say, I'm not going to go to Congress. 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 i Mammy, <laughs> Standing in what? 
She said my children are the ones that are supposed to be doing that. As if I'm happy or it's my fault to be gentleless. Is it my fault? Why? Mama. Mama. Ah ah. Kill any master. Only. Lori or I don't want to be Listen to the boom. When did Tim Bass be a Tim Bass boom call, Tim Bass sorrow call. Check in there, lake in the king, Dale Cooney. So I could cry there long, like Bewa for me. My love, see, Lenya, my caro, my caro, lost it. I could not pull out the ballet of my last of a ya. Oh, go, 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 but she lo ye ke ma sha dua fun wa na o lo ma da wa lohun na o adua kini de kule o fe yawo mi o emi o ni ko ko ile yi ile sugbo fe yawo mi temi nu o agbalo nda lo yi o mo fe ro mo mo mi o fe nti obi mo fun mi my mom would not allow my wife to rest. She frustrated her to the point that she almost backed out from this marriage. She almost released me to marry another woman. And I could not. Until one day, when my mother sent a message to me that she was seriously ill and died. Mama, could you call it the other one? What do you want to do? Nothing. <laughs> Mi nba ni ko wa o ni wa mo ton wa le ni ah ah ko wa ke se be ibi ti mo tin bo jina die ko le da na ni onu en ti mo fe ko fe fun mi nu to mi lo la lo ko re mo da da si ni bo ti so fun yi pe christian ni mi se mo esin mi o de fa ye gba ogoru nko be yen mi le fe yawo meji o de ya for us ile I be on you, you won't see Bodo be here. For a single, call down your junta one leg. Tommy Lola, Loba call, Lord Duke, it's your core. Lord Duke, what are you? Mommy, I'm funny, sir. Don't go to your wife, you are not. Joko, Joko, Joko. What? Say that, that, say, Paul, boy, you want to. What is the meaning of all this? Why do you lie here? Man, you go say don't share room, come by more. Mama, mama, low. You may face it, me no. Kilo de. Due to carelessness, I got into Tommy Lola, and I lost my guard. I had contact with her only once, and I realized that I've done something very, very wrong. So I pleaded with God. And I decided not to have anything to do with her again. My decision stood. Not until one fateful day, when me and my wife visited Mama. Mommy. Yeah, Missy. <laughs> hey, Lembo. Hey, I am me. Yes, Mama. Like we like Jin. Oh, finish soon. Oh, finish bomb up. Oh, back. Oh, babu for me. I don't know. Lonely some So it's about? Yes. You don't know, Lily Bimino. She won't talk to me. Hey, Lossy lay down. Call the one cut up or you day. Be a malani, a lubon, Benny, Bita Dissi, or Beno, one, eh, be. Go be canna, go soon, Jawa. Yammy, 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 Mm-hmm. Oh, you move for a low Call it Daniel. Yeah, we to me, Lola. What you know? Ah. Are you okay? Mm. 
o se ma loyun loyun ba wo ah so for money se ko se nkan kan to se len se ma loyun o loyun oh my god ko wa be se se bo gbo e o so ti ri bi telu ba wa ya mi si i was so shocked at that news could she be pregnant I had no choice than to confess to my wife. She felt so bad, but she forgave me. And a year after, she became pregnant. Mama! Mama! Tani! I got some shoes. Tell me, Lola. What do you remember? I'm going to go. So, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Eba mi so fun kun le o. Lati igba ti yawo e ti loyun lo ti ko bi ara si mi mo. A ki lo de se mi mi na bi mo fun. Se ko ju ba lo. Ko ju be lo mami. Emi o mo di ti o fi je kin gbe pelu won. Ko tun ni le fun mi lo to ma to toju omo. Ah. Oh, joko. Da gbogbo re da mi. So ti gbo. Gbogbo re o ni pe niyan ju lai pe yo. Fo kan re ba le. Emi mo bi kan ni. So ti bo. Danu ara re ju. Mo 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 boju je. O gbo re. O ni ju lai pe. Omo mi nko jo nu nko. O ti lo si deke. Mo wa ri mami ni mo ni pe kin. Kin ya kin kin wa kin. E ba mi ba soro. O da ni da ni. Ni da da mi. So ti bo. Ba lo wa pa gbo boju e ba yen. I never knew she could go this wild and stubborn. Since then, I have been taking responsibilities of both the mother and the son. But yet, she would not let me rest. What's the problem, Oni? Eh? You've been here for long. I'm sorry for putting you through all this. It's all my fault. I've told you times without number to stop saying all this. Eh? It's alright. Hmm? It is well. Yes. You have not even eaten much before she came in and intruded into our privacy. Please, just come on. Hmm? You first. Let's take our sofa note. One to go. Do do. Do I like the way you are taking it? Cough a bit. <coughs> it's okay. Yeah. It's okay. It's okay. Let's go again. Do In group. Me, do, me, so, let's go. Do, me, so, so, me, do. Mm, that's not the way I want it. <coughs> A bit. <coughs> okay, it's okay. Do, me, so, so, me, do. Then I want to go. Do, me, so. So I have a song that I want to teach you. Are you with your notes, everybody? Yes, sir. Bring out your notes. One, two, go. So so mi so do ti la la fa la. Okay. Ti ti la so fa mi mi fa so mi do do la so do ti la la. Oh, my darling. Peter, I'm sorry. Let me help you. Thank you. I'm good. I was only trying to breathe, mom. Just... Love to me. Yeah. 
I have to go. All right. I'll see you later. Mom, why? What has Peter done? Has he offended you? He was only trying to greet you. Shake or shit, you bad before. Have you greeted me before accusing me wrongly? Ah. Bless you, Mom. Bless you. Mom, you see, Peter and his mom have been have been always nice to me. So just try to be nice to him too. Okay. I'm sorry I overreacted. Hmm? Oh my darling, I need to tell you this. <laughs> don't get carried away by their show of love and kindness. Those people don't like you. They don't want you alive. So you have to be careful. But why would they do that? Because they want Peter to acquire all your father's wealth. That's why they didn't allow me to live with them. Alright, mom, I will try I will try to be careful. So what do you bring for me? I have a lot of things for you. So how is your music school going? It's going fine. I hope you're you're facing what you're doing. Yeah, mom, oh, yeah. I have a lot of things for you. Okay, exist. <laughs> Peter. I'm sorry for what I've been doing. I hope you don't have a good. Ah, John! Never mind. I'm fine. It's no problem. Please, kindly forgive mom. She doesn't mean it. John! Ah, what do I gain in fighting mom? I'm not even offended. <laughs> but, uh, but why, why are you not? What she did not? Yes, that's because I want to be like Jesus. Who oh, forgive those who offended and said, Father, forgive them for they know not what they are doing. Are you suggesting that my mom doesn't know what she's doing? Maybe. Maybe not. But I just want to be like Jesus. <sighs> I know the response you will give. You have something to do with Jesus. <laughs> Jesus only is a message. Jesus only is a message. We will lift up Jesus ever, Jesus holy. We will sing Jesus only, Jesus ever, Jesus all in all we sing, Savior Son. Fire Ila Baptize and call me kings. John, did you think a man with this kind of joy would be offended about the brother? And oh no. So nice. Peter, I love this song. Please, can you sing it again? <laughs> Jesus only. Ah, ah, okay. I told you I have to be somewhere by 4 p.m. now. Mm, I beg no vest. My boss, they give us instructions. That's why I'm sorry. Anyway, I want to find out what's your take on what I discussed with you. you. Ah. Hmm. What I'm about to say is difficult. But that's the solution. How difficult can it be? Talk to me now. You know, what's, what matters to me now is my stability in that house. You cannot enjoy the stability as long as Peter remains alive. Peter has to die. And you will remain the only woman who stay as a child in your husband's house. Is that what you say is difficult? <laughs> you don't want to know how much I hate that guy. But how do I go about it? Um, I have a very good idea. You will only eliminate Peter, but implicate his mom. Find out what she would prepare as breakfast tomorrow. I mean, you can confirm that through your son. Then... Ah! Ronke! You are evil. Kai! Hey, come on, so nay, not a lamb, so dear. 
kama ani kama yana selita me ha so come hai come ina ina tuzeta kusika pola ina kozi na tete tuza e mai Now I believe everybody has studied the notes very very well. Yes, yes sir. Yes, we are going straight to the song now. Are you with the lyrics? Yes, yes sir. Good. Okay, let's go now. Open my eyes, Lord, right in my steps. Illuminate the parts of my life. That which I know not, in that which I'm confused. Open my eyes today. Open my eyes, Lord, right in my steps. Illuminate the parts of my life. That which I know not, in that which I'm confused. Open my eyes today. Let the Savior lead the way, let His presence guide my path. As we join in the wilderness of this life, let me trust Him all. Let His counsel guide me, Lord. Open my eyes today. How are you, my boy? Yeah, I'm fine, Mom. I hope you're doing good. Yes. And you, Peter, how are you? I'm fine. I'm so sorry about what happened the other day. Uh, please forgive me, okay? How is your mom? She's fine. Oh. Well, mommy. I don't think I have seen you in this mood before. What's your secret? <laughs> Darling, it is Jesus. Mom, Jesus. Yes. You may now have Jesus in your life and is the source of this great joy. John, my darling, I'm telling you. Jesus gives freedom to your soul. <laughs> Boys, I, I realize your lunch break will soon be over. Yes. Yes. I bought you something. A very cold drink for both of you. <laughs> Thank you, Mom. <laughs> so here is for you, Peter. And here is for you, John. So guys, sit down and please take your drink before it gets hot. Thank you, Mom. <laughs> Just settle down and take your time. <laughs> Don't worry, it's like that. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. That's a very good one. Now we are taking the second solo, and that will be taken by Peter and Ed. Enola, where's Peter? He went out. He went out. He went out? Yes, sir. When did you realize he's going on? What nonsense? Go and call them for me, my friend. Okay, sir. What nonsense is that? In my class. Peter! Peter! Ah. Come over, come Peter. here now. Come here, answer me. Peter! Mommy, I need to go now. I'm coming. You have to take your drink before you go. I think I'll teach her the man my And you can go with it! What is wrong with this stupid boy? Look at the way he just, he just messed up the whole drink. Oh God, this boy is a fool! Mom, why? I thought you said you would not have Jesus. He didn't spill out intentionally. Where are they? He's coming, sir. Where are you coming from? What happened to you? I'm sorry, sir. When did you realize it's going on? I will not tolerate this in my class again. Yes, sir. Now, let's go straight to the chorus. Open my eyes, Lord, right in my steps. Illuminate the parts of my life. That which I know not, in that which I'm confused. Open my eyes today. Oh, see, there. Oh? 
I heard about the incessant visit of Tomlola to her children's school. And I don't like it. She was there to give them some things. Is anything wrong in that? Everything is bad about it. I don't trust that woman. I mean, then there was a time that Peter returned from the music school and he, he came home with bruises all over his body. He said Tomlola pushed him away and he sustained injury because of that. And today, she was there to give them juice. I mean, she doesn't like my son. Let her just stay away. Ah! Don't draw any conclusion yet. She may just be missing them. Oh! If she's missing her son, let her go and see her son. And leave my son alone. I'll be... Ah. After all, the Bible says, watch and pray. I can't be too sensitive when it comes to issue of my son. Please. Ah! But remember, she also has her son in that school. I'm not stopping her from seeing her son. Let her go and see her son. And if she continues like this, honestly, I will draw my son from that music school. I will, I will fix him up in another place. Okay. It has not gotten to that. I'll fix it my own way. I just hope your own way will be hot and fast. Because I cannot allow somebody to come and kill my son. No. Yeah, Missy. Ah, Mr. Dekule, Peter is the only son. Only one. Remember, I don't have to. Get down! Get down! Get down now! Hello, hello. We, we can't trace them. We can't get them. Mr. Dekunle? Uh, yes, this is Mr. Dekunle. Please, what can I do for you? Do. Daddy! I think you rather wait for what we can do for you. Your children were lost. But we found them. And they are here with us. Ah, th thank you very much. They are my precious children. Please, please. Um, where, where are you now? Where are you? Where exactly are you? Where, where are they? We'll call you back later. See your lips. See your lips. Hello. Oh, Hello. God. Hello. Oh my God. In the name of my son. Hey. Oh my God. <laughs> Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. What is it? Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't leave me alone. Wow, that was. Remove that black shade before speaking to us. Okay. Honestly, that was a clean job. 
I love the way you guys work. I just knew you guys would be trusted for this. <laughs> anyway, um, here. Are you sure this is the complete balance? The ransom to be demanded is 50 million naira. 50 what? Is that not much? I know my client, so you listen to me. 50 million naira. 50 50. Deal. Deal. Hey, the toilet in the secret place of the most high. Shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge, my fortress, and my God. In Him will I trust. Surely he shall deliver me from the snare of the fowler and from the noisome pestilence. He shall cover me with his feathers, and under his wings shall I trust. His truth shall be my shield and my buckler. Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the harrow that flies by day, nor for the pestilence. I walk it in darkness, not for the destruction <laughs> that wasted at noon day. A thousand shall fall at my side, and ten thousand at my right hand, but they shall not come near me. Only, Only with thy eyes shall, shall, shall thou behold and see, see the reward of the wicked. For thou hast made the, made the Lord, Lord which is my refuge. refuge. Even, Even the most high, the habitation. There shall be no evil before thee, neither shall any plague come nigh the dwelling, for he shall give his angels charge over thee to keep thee in other ways. For they shall bear thee up in their hands, lest thou dash thy foot against the stone. Thou shalt tread upon a lion and adder. The young lion and dragon shall not trample on the feet, for he has set his love for me. Therefore will I deliver him and set him on high, because he has known my name. I will call upon him and he will answer me. He will be with me in trouble. He will deliver me and honor me. With long life he will satisfy me and show me his salvation. You know about Jesus of the Bible? Yes, and I'm happy I have a friend who has the same belief as mine. We are here for a reason. We wish the Lord will reveal. Now it's time to negotiate your life or death. No, it has been done long ago when that was the sentence over my life and then the master came and paid for my freedom with his blood. Uh, I'm so. There is no room for reposition. You must be drunk! You think so? Yes, baby girl. He is drunk. He is. <laughs> Hello. The price of your children's life is 50 million naira. Stop shouting! Stop it! Why not? Hello, Daddy. We are here, sir. We are here. John is also here. You have heard your voices. Be fast about it. Ah. 50 million naira. How do I get 50 million naira? They don't even give room for negotiation. And it is so risky to involve the police. 
because of the lives of my children. 50 million. Two children. Peter and John. Peter and John. Peter and John. John. This is too much. Jesus, please save this boy. Save these children, oh God. Ah, give them the courage to stand in a time like this. In the name of Jesus, oh great deliverer, please deliver these boys from the state of the fowler. Bring them back home to us safely, Lord. Let them return in peace. In the name of Jesus, oh God Almighty, disappoint the craftiness of the crafty, oh God. In the mighty name of Jesus, ah, let the wickedness of the wicked be turned against death. Jesus! Jesus, save these children, oh God. Give them, oh God, give them, oh God. My dear, it is well. Amen. God will take control. Amen. And I'm sure they will come back to us safely. Amen. Are you crying? No. No. It's alright. We'll find them. Peter. Um, so, <clears throat> I'm listening. Yes, boss. We've been able to get 150 million naira so far. And we are still expecting some funds from uh, the guidance. Yes, boss. We have two new kids now custody. Yeah. Uh, we did an intelligent kidnap. Mm. And the ransom of 50 million naira is expected from them, boss. Yeah, 50 million naira. Yes, sir. Very good, yeah. <laughs> well done, guys. Well done, well done. Do not forget, I still have a very serious case to resolve at hand. You know, my own son too was kidnapped. And I will not rest until that fool, that idiot is found. King Boss! Guys, you have to be very careful. Always watch your back. And do clean jobs. This box. What did I say? Clean jobs. I'll visit the dungeon very soon. Yeah. Mm. Perfect. Problem boss. Yeah. What is your name? My name is John Adekunle. And you? 
It's a, a depule. I was told you refused to eat since you got here. Why? Men shall not live by bread alone. I seek freedom, not food. Stone, why have you been offering them bread alone? Doors. We have never offered them bread. You heard him. He said he has never offered you bread. So what happened? Languages of dispute. They cannot be understood by mere men. What? Who is this bloated rat? You call me a mere man. Me? A mere man? Do you know your lives are in my hands? No. Our lives are not in your hands. Rather, your lives are in our hearts. Because we can decide your fate here and now. What audacity! Do you even know who you are referring to? Who are you? I am Peter Adekule, the son of the Most High God, a royal priesthood. What? <laughs> How dare you talk to me, sister? Do you know who I am? Who the hell are you? And what makes you special among us all? Have you heard anything from the parents? Not yet, sir. Then I guess I need to waste this idiot. No, no, no. Please, sir. We will speak again. Sir, sir please stop replying them for our parents. Yes, please. You know that I don't always keep quiet when I face people who don't know it. Everlasting confidence, confidence in the Lord. Everlasting confidence, confidence in the Lord. Everlasting confidence, confidence in the Lord. Everlasting confidence. Sister, after this office, I will need you to pray for me. I like this opportunity. It is the back. I'll be back. I need to rest my head now. Shut up! My dear, don't you think we need to involve the police? That may be too risky. We don't even know these people. And if at any moment they discover that uh, we have involved the police, the lives of our children will be in danger. Hey, but what if we give them the money, collect the money, and they still refuse to release the children? God forbid. God forbid. Amen. I soak this cash into the blood of Jesus. Amen. If they collect it, God will touch their heart. Amen. Though I have a fear in that direction, that's where I think we should begin to pray that God should take control of the whole process. Amen. Are you going alone with the cash? Yes. I'll go alone. But I think you need to go with someone. Why can't you just go with somebody? Maybe the pastor or the closest relation of friends because it would be too risky for you to go there alone my dear god will go with me the holy spirit of god will follow me amen uh, because this is a huge amount of money and at this point i can no longer trust any man especially with cash but only God can be trustworthy in all situations. He will follow me. He will guide me. He will stay with me. His presence will be with me. Amen. His presence will be in the front. Amen. And at my back. Amen. God will lay his hand upon this money. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Ah. <laughs> so, when do you want to call them? 
because we don't have all the time and uh, those boys are too young for the experiences they've been going through recently honestly ah uh, it's painful yes yes they are too young I, I will call them as soon as we are done praying. We'll pray before I leave. Jesus. Peter. I'm afraid. I think you should take things easy. This, these people are dangerous. Sean. I understand you. But we cannot be totally silent. I mean, we all fear these faces, but we need to be able to answer them in godly wisdom. Godly wisdom? Is, is this whole idea of godly wisdom not, not leading you to the grave? The righteous shall be bold as a lion. John, whichever way, we are already in trouble, whether we talk or not. So anytime a child of God falls into an uncontrollable situation like this, we must summon the courage of Dene, Shadrach, Mizek, and Abednego. Yes, because it is in that courage we have delivered. We all are here for a purpose. And that purpose of which you are here is to die. I see no freedom for you here. It is not given to you to see freedom. Freedom is spiritual. It is completed in the spiritual realm and then manifested miraculously in the physical without the approval of any man. Then I'd like to see you rise and go through those locked bars. We are still saying the same thing. It is not about opening the bars. It is spiritual. Songs and prayers open the locked bars. It is the same song that fell down the Jericho wall. We don't know the spiritual root to this freedom because it is spiritual. But we know there is a God in heaven. In Jesus' name we are prayed. Amen. 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 Ah, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Don't you talk? Do you understand what they are saying? Hello, this is Mr. Dekule, the father of uh, John and Peter. Please. I already have the entire cash with me. Oh, the entire 50 million naira? Good. Please don't play any smart game. And don't involve the police or anyone. Or else, your children will be used for suya. Um, no, no, I have not involved the police and I will not involve the police. Please, for God's sake, be faithful on your part of this deal. I, I will leave the house now, but I will be expecting. Be with you very soon. Boss, they are ready. You want to shoot me? Only this can happen. You shoot me, and I will die in the body. But my spirit will go straight to heaven if the Lord wants it now. Two, you pull the trigger. I shoot and it does not work. Is that all? Is that all? Ah! Let's pull the trigger. Pull the trigger, let's see if it's not gonna work. Pull, pull it. No sense. <laughs> He said, he said, I should not try to place man. Ah, Jesus. You are the man to come. Jesus. Say it again. Jesus. You follow me there. Jesus. 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 Jesus.
Hey, come on, Sunaina. In a home, I pass on the day. He come, 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 Switch off your hazard light. Good. Switch it on. Switch off the light and a light from that car. Jump up twice. Please, I came alone. I did not involve anybody, not even the police. Please. Because if you did, you will live here dead. And your children will be dead. Ah, please, please, please. Please don't kill them. Where's the money? It's in the car. The money is in the car. I came with the money. I hope what is in the garden fuck black bag is money. Yes, it is. See you. <clears throat> oh, no, no, no. Don't carry the bag on your head like a fool. Carry it with your hands. Okay. Now go through that narrow path until you see a tree tied with a red cloth around it. Listen to what I'm telling you first. You drop that money there and leave immediately if you value your life. Now, come back to your car. Good. Good job. What, what about my children? Where will I find them? Your children? You will see them at the appointed time. You have fulfilled your own side of the deal. Wait for us to deliver our own consignment. Okay. And hop into your car and move. Two more seconds there, it will drop you dead. Congratulations, guys, on a job well done. You see, it's wow. nice doing business with you after all. Ah. My percentage? The boss has not decided whether to give you or not. When are they mad? I beg, Muna, no joke with me. Oh. Something they do in our brain. I beg, Muna, don't play with me. Oh. Muna, don't play with me at all. Where my money? <laughs> no, 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 answer me! The baby is ah. fucking funny person. Come down. Come down. Someone cannot play with you. I mean, is this how you used to do? <laughs> anyway, that is an expensive joke. Okay, so we move to the next assignment. Oh. About releasing the boys. Well, one of them has to be released. The other one has to be killed. Lady, that's too harsh. 
Would it not be nice if you give those boys to their parents after paying the ransom? When did you start doing nice things? We are not nice at all, though. I am very harsh. Will you do it or will you not? Which of them do you want killed? The one named Peter. Big, that's the problem here. Because I actually don't know any fucking person called Peter. Here. Can you give me the physical nomenclature of this guy called Peter? Um, the shorter and the younger one. Just kill him and and bring back the other one. I hope you know the price of your life. I'm paying you more for the job. <laughs> Gabijin, Gabinjat. Give and take. Consider the job done. It's a done deal. No, 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 no. This is not possible. This is not possible. Not under my nose. No one is killing Peter. Boss! This is a work. We have been paid for. No emotion, sir. This is not about emotions. It's about knowledge. Knowledge is scarce. So when you get it, you keep it. Boss, boss. Can you see that thing called Peter as knowledge? With all the history they called on you, boss. That is exactly what I'm saying. The boy did not insult me in any way. He only opened my eyes to see things I need to be a man. Which is courage, tenacity, boldness. Tell me, who among you has the effrontery to speak up in front of a fully armed person? Who? Who? Tell me. None, right? I thought as much. You see, we cannot kill that boy. We need to learn a lot from him. That's what I'm saying. But his life has been paid for. My life? Man is too small to pay for my life. He took God, his only begotten son, to buy my life. It was a game of life for life and not money for life. Whoever takes money for life shall lose that life in rapid succession. In the name of Jesus Christ, the only one who is qualified as a prize for life. Are you mad? Is something wrong with your head? I am pointing a gun at your head and you are not scared. Do you know what this is? It can kill you. You see, you lack knowledge and you need a lot of orientation. Let me help you. The gun can only kill the body and not the soul. And what do I need the body for? Be not afraid of the man who can kill the body and not the soul. But fear the man who can kill the body and the soul in hell. If you and others like you, killing children of God, really knows that all you can kill is only the body and not the soul, maybe you would retreat. It is only when your soul dies that you actually die. Don't you talk! Don't you talk! Please, please don't kill me, I beg of you, please. Shut up! You don't have any idea of what you're saying. You are so dumb! You are so empty! I'm going to kill you! I beg of you. If I spare your life, what will I get? Why should I spare your life? You have nothing to offer me. Ha! Ah, John! Why not give me a leave, John? John! I congratulate you. Now you have your home to yourself. Thank you very much, Ore. You know, it was a very clean job. Well, I will soon go and see my son because he will soon be released. But I would like to go and see his son's shameful body. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, lest I forget, you're ready to ask a drama. When your husband and his wife begins to weep, 
show a lot of soberness and compassion. Ah! Runke, you are evil. Ah. We are both evil now. Eh? Yes, we are evil. Hey, mommy, love me. <laughs> Wow, you guys are so impressive. I bet I'll choose you over and over again. Anytime, anytime. Wow. This is so good. What? What? Who killed my son? Who did this to my son? You told us to kill Peter and we will kill Pete. No! I told you to kill Peter! This is John, not Peter! This is my son! Who did this? It is our boss that killed him. I think it was a mistake. A mistake! A mistake! It was not a mistake. I killed him because he deserved to die. Why? What? 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 See, boy, what are you doing here? See, girl. Oh, I knew it. That our path will cross. Where is my son? Why did you do this to me? You killed my son. I won't ask you again. Where is my son? This is your son. You just murdered your own son. What? What? This is strange. Do you recognize any voice? Yes. So. Mommy Tommy Lola arranged our kidnap. So, John is the son of the boss of this dungeon, and not my father's son? Wickedness. Serious wickedness. He that digs a pit shall fall there in. Is that what we are? You are not boys caught free. No. Don't do it. Don't do it. I won't right. allow you both to go this time around. Don't try this. You killed my son. You are surrounded. Drop the weapon. Drop it. Drop it. I can smell freedom. Can you hear the sound of freedom? Please, can I attain the same freedom? Yes, you are also free. They came to take us all. I'm not talking about this freedom, but the spiritual freedom. You mean Jesus Christ? Yes. All you have to do is to accept him as your personal Lord and Savior and ask for the forgiveness of your sins. I'm ready. I'm ready, please. I'm ready. Say after me. Okay. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Forgive me all my sins. Forgive me all my sins. Let me be for you. Let me be for you. Begin to guide me. Begin to guide in me. Jesus in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, I pray. You are also free now. <sighs> ah, those who put their trust in you shall not be put to shame, says your word. Holy Spirit, you will not put us to shame. You will not put me to shame, oh. Peter, Jesus. Ah! <laughs> Lord. Your name is a strong tower, Jesus. Righteous, trust into it. That is not available. Ah! Not reachable. Ah! Not available. Ah! Not reachable. Ah, my God, Lord Jesus, have mercy on me. If you don't help me, nobody will help me. Lord, you are too faithful to fail me. Don't fail me. God, help me. Help me. Ah, Lord Jesus, help me. Help me. Help me. It's a breath of relief as some kidnappers were arrested by the police this morning. They were discovered with some guns and harmful weapons. And some young boys and girls in their custody have been rescued. But one reported. Oh my God. Huyon Chuku, Ezem Wam, reporting for Baba TV. Ah, God.
Why did you not preserve John? But why would they kill him? Why? Dad, I didn't just want you to say anything aside of Thanksgiving. Do you know John is not a son, but the son of the boss of the dungeon? Eh? Yeah. John is not my son. When we get home, I will explain more. That is, meets Deborah, a new friend who is also rich in the word of God. How are, How you? are you, Deborah? God bless you. Mm -hmm. Have they contacted your parents as well? Yes, ma'am. They are on their way. Oh, that's very good. She's well with you. Deborah, we shall yeah. see soon, eh? Bye. It's all right. Okay. Good to have you here once again. And the whole world has been enjoying your testimony, and it has been a great one. But the question is, how were you able to survive the whole experience, considering you're young at your age? Can I start with you, Deborah? In this kingdom, or in Christ, there is nothing like age. Age is not a factor to be in God's program. It was the presence of God that covered us through. Yes, exactly what I wanted to say. If you are a carrier of God's presence, there is no situation you will not submerge because His presence is there with you. Just like Daniel in the lion's den and the three evil boys in the fairy furnace. Wow, interesting. But how come you both had this understanding considering you're young? Kudos to our parents who taught us the way of the Lord. They enforced memory verse on us through the daily morning devotion. Sometimes when I sleep, they come and pray for me. Now God should capture me in his hands. Exactly. My parents are my inspiration. This is the first place every child grows from. Hmm. This got me. I hope you've just heard from them that parents at home, if you do not train up your child in the way they should grow, they will definitely learn the way of the devil. Whichever way, one way must be learned. So back to you, Deborah and Peter. My last question to you. What advice would you like to give to young ones like yourself? Knowledge is power. And divine knowledge can save everyone from trouble. Let everybody like me make the Bible a partner and study it. The Bible says, study to show yourself approved unto God. A worked man that needed not to be ashamed. Wow, interesting. Thank you very much. It's been an awesome time having you both here. And we hope you honor our invitation next time we have you in our studio. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. Thanks for coming. Bye. Hello, Peter. How are you? Oh, my wonderful daughter. Oh, you make me proud. how are you? Oh, great. Okay. Really? Oh, I hope they'll be very excited to honor your invitation. Well, I, I can't say about that, but I'll have to get back to you as soon as I get a consent from them. All right. Yeah, I'll get back to you. Bye. Thank you, ma. You have lovely kids. Oh, oh, thank, thank you. you ma. Peter, Deborah, you had barely left the studio when I received a call from Abuja for an invitation to minister at a youth convention on the 16th of next month. Yes. Minister, we are not pastors. <laughs> but your pain has qualified you to be one. Mm. You know, after every prison, there's always a palace. You have the scars, you have the track record, and the world will love to hear it from you. It's your purpose. Dad, what do you see? Um, it's okay. Did you say the conference will take place in Abuja on the 16th of... Next month. 16th of next month. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, we will bring God's ministers. <laughs> Thank you so much, sir. But how will we know what to say when we get it? You see, God has given you a message. Because when God wants to give message to his children and wants them to be his mouthpiece, sometimes he puts them in situations that are uncomfortable. Mm. 
so that the pain they pass through will be their message when they become victorious. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So the pain that you have passed through is your message. Wow. wow. <laughs> Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank you very much. We'll be eager to host them. Okay, well, I think we should be on our way. My wife will be waiting for us. Eh? Oh, uh, our <laughs> regards to her, please. Okay. Deborah, take good care of yourself. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, very much. Thank you. Okay. Of a living king, does she not? Oh, my woman, fire, fire, a queen ship of fire, fire, fire. Fire, 